Cardboard Box. Welcome to Cardboard Box. If there's one thing that I've learned from your comments and feedback, it's that you like your animation to be smooth. So it was no surprise when you voted for me to review Craft Smooth Peanut Butter. This Voyager class size container comes in at a whopping one kilogram. Its ingredients include select roasted peanuts, soybean oil, corn maltodextrin, sugar, hydrogenated vegetable oil made out of cottonseed and rapeseed, salt, and mono and diglycerides. And I don't know what those are. I'm really glad that it's not made of ground up teddy bears. Now for comparisons. Here is smooth peanut butter next to a can of green peas, mild salsa, some honey in a bear container, some icing, a can of pineapple soda, a bag of chocolate chips, and a slice of bread. Some people out there don't like peanut butter. They think it's bad. If you have a deadly allergy to peanut butter, I can understand that point of view. But I can assure you that Kraft Smooth Peanut Butter is good. The same may not apply to Kraft Crunchy Peanut Butter though. How can we tell for sure? Well, green often means good. Green means go. It means correct. It means approved. Red, on the other hand, often means bad, or stop, or wrong, or restricted. Also, those bears on the chunky peanut butter literally look evil. Would you let bears like that into your home? I don't think so. Go away, Chunky. I don't care if my wife likes you on toast. Scram. According to the Maple Leaf on the label, this is Canada's favorite. Hey man, it's uncalled for. Smooth won the vote fair and square. This sort of behavior won't be tolerated. Did I forget to mention that Smooth Peanut Butter also comes in leader class? Long live heroic Smooth Peanut Butter. Can you think of any examples where green means bad and red means good? Also, do you have pineapple soda where you live? If not, you're missing out.